wait 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 okay this is better so as you could probably tell from the title of this video guys I am officially I have officially started my cutting season so I'm going to be way more shredded in about eight weeks so uh, I started this series to show everyone what I'm doing on a daily basis so basically what I'm going to eat how many calories I'm going to have each day how I'm going to decrease the carbs am I going to do refits I don't know yet we'll see in the next video so uh, now it's time to hit the gym unfortunately I cannot bring you very much footage from my workout I'm going to train legs today it's Sunday and afterwards I'm going to explain you guys my whole approach on this eight weeks preparation because I'm going to compete in two shows first one uh, it's UK BFF North and West Championships West Championships which is going to be on 30 of April and the other one is Body Power Model Search the final which will be on 13 and 14 of May so there is going to be about two weeks difference between the shows eight weeks out and ten weeks out let's go I just got back from the gym, took a shower and now I'm ready to discuss with you my whole cutting approach. Let's start with the beginning, the most important thing, the calorie intake. I will take myself as an example, but you can apply those principles in your own cutting approach. So, for me I found that in order to maintain my weight I need to eat about 2900 calories. and in order to gain weight, I will need to eat about 3,300. So, I decided to lower my calories to about 2,600 in order to start to lose weight, to get shredded. Now, the macros. Um, the most important thing about the macros is your protein intake because once you start cutting, you are going to lose a lot of weight and in order to not lose muscle mass you need to to protect your muscles with amino acids and protein um, fat I will keep my fat up at about 16 grams because fat is very important when it comes to cutting especially and the only thing that I'm going to play with are the carbs right so now I'm starting with 320 grams of carbs, which is maybe a little bit too much, but I will take this very slowly and I'm going to decrease it day by day, week by week maybe. Okay, the third thing is your training approach, my training approach in this, in this case, which I think is not very, very important as long as you train properly with a good form and train all your body parts. So, my uh, routine is a 4 day split which focuses on compound movements. For the first day chest and triceps I will do for sure chest press. 
uh, back and biceps, I will do deadlifts, uh, delts and traps, third day I'm going for, for over shoulder press and last but not least legs I will do squats so these four compound movements are going to be in every single day of training right obviously after the fourth day I'm, I'm going to take a day off in order to rest so sets and reps now uh, this is this is in my opinion one of the most discussed topics when it comes to training but me personally uh, I will go for three to six sets depending on the movement maybe I will do more sets uh, on the isolation exercises and I will go between 8 and 15 reps now here uh, maybe in the last week I'm not going to lift very heavy so I maybe raise this this number oops <laughs> I will raise this number and go for like 20 reps maybe I'm not sure yet cardio many people <laughs> think that if they are doing cardio they are going to lose a lot of weight and they will get very shredded and get fit and you know which is true but false at the same time because uh, I will do cardio for example only after the week 4 I have all my weeks here with the calories that I'm going to eat weekly which is general I'm going to make a few changes here and there but this is it right the last week the peak week uh, whatever so uh, cardio is not needed as long as you are in a calorie deficit so for example if you want to eat more or if you are already in a very big deficit and you cannot lose any more weight then yeah cardio is needed of course but it's not a must right as long as you can lose weight and eat a good amount of food and last but not least let's say in my opinion not the very important part are is sorry the supplementation so many people think that taking a lot of supplements will, will help them to get very shredded or build a lot of muscle in the other case when they are bulking but that's false right yeah they're going to give you that extra boost in it they will push you a little bit but there's not magic in them so the most important thing when it comes to supplements on any period of the of the year even on cutting maintaining or bulking you are going to need creatine monohydrate creatine I'm not going to talk in depth about those supplements but maybe in another episode if you request it uh, second one whey protein uh, I'm going to use whey protein daily in order to hit this 170 grams goal which is a little bit too much for me uh, BCAA uh, I will take about 5 to 10 grams daily uh, but only when I'm starting to do cardio and pre-workout <laughs> now pre-workout uh, I don't know yet but I think that I'm going to use it a lot every single day which is not very good but I really need pre-workouts when I'm on, the, on a deficit and of course here omega-3 and vitamin complex those are some essential things when it comes to cutting especially so yeah guys this is my cutting approach uh, straightforward there is no magic in it I'm just going to stick to the plan maybe make a few changes but that's it so I, have, I hope you found it useful if you need help in order to make your cutting plan give me a shout leave a question in the comment section below or DM me on Instagram whatever I'm happy to help you all so catch you in the next clip bye I just realized that I did not really close this vlog so at the moment it's 11 p.m. It's Sunday and I'm making some meal preps for the week. Let's see what I'm cooking right now.
guys it's midnight right now this is going to conclude this video the first video of the series I hope you enjoyed it if you did please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more thank you very much guys see you in the next one bye